where they feel blocked or they feel like, you know, like they've lost themselves or they've lost what was meaningful for them for their life. And I, I feel a lot when you are doing uh, your chanting and your drumming, um, a lot of times it brings up a lot of emotions that perhaps I'm having difficulty releasing through whatever things I do, you know, if it's yoga, if it's meditation, if it's exercise, if it's just daily life, you know, sometimes you just kind of build up this routine and you forget self-care. With your drumming, to me, you bring this flow of emotion, this this peaceful feeling that it's okay to release these emotions. It's okay to go deep and it's okay to like, let it go and be free. That's how you touch me a lot. Um, you know, and, and especially I think back to when I was going through cancer, you know, and you came to, you know, South Georgia, and we were drumming on, you know, the back porch or in the, in the hospital and everything like that, you know, you helped me release a lot of this fear that I had been holding on to that, you know, that the doctors were not giving me any kind of good words, you know, that it just seemed like it just kept building and building of like you know this this cancer was in me and you know we'll do what we can but you know it's it it's not curable you know it's we can treat it but we don't you know it was all this and when you came it was just like I was able to you know through tears through breathing it was like I was able to like you know, release this huge or break into the fear a little bit, you know, 